begin thinking about Luther's background. Now, two things to grasp about um, Luther's background. Uh, the first was that he was a monk. Um, monasticism. Or strictly speaking, he wasn't a monk, he was a friar. Um, he was an Augustinian friar. And he became a friar through a particular incident that you may have heard of. Um, he was visiting his, his, um, his father back in uh, Mansfeld, a little town um, uh, not far away from Erfurt, which is where he was at university in, in Germany. And uh, he was on his way back from his father's house. They'd maybe had a little bit of an argument about uh, the direction his life was taking. And he was on his way back to, to Erfurt, and he passed by a little village called Stottenheim. And as he passed by this village, uh, there was a sort of, it was in July uh, 1509, and um, a sort of summer thunderstorm um, hit the area where he was. And as he was walking along this, this road, and, and this, he gives us the impression that he was in a little bit of a turmoil, wondering what direction his life was, was taking, wondering about his own salvation. And anyway, this, um, this, this thunderstorm hit. Um, a bolt of lightning hit the ground very near to where he was. He fell down to the ground, absolutely terrified, and in his moment of terror, cried out, Saint Anne, help me, I will become a monk. Uh, Saint Anne was a kind of patron saint of the local area where he was, and this was a desperate cry, you know, please help me, under the sort of terror of God's, God's judgment. And um, he decides to become a monk, and the reason he becomes a monk is quite simple. He says later on, I didn't become a monk because I wanted an easy life. Um, uh, I didn't become a monk for any other reason um, than to save my soul. Uh, for him, the, the, the road of monasticism was the, it was the, the fast lane to salvation. 